Hi, Black Bob students. Welcome to my first online music class. Today we're going to start with All Are Welcome. It's a book that I love to start the beginning of the school year with, and I just want you to follow along and listen. Pencils sharpened in their case, bells are ringing, let's make haste. School's beginning, dreams to chase, all are welcome here. No matter how you start your day, what you wear, when you play, or if you come from far away, all are welcome here. Did you hear something that was the same on page one and page two? That's right, the last line was the same. On both pages, we ended with, all are welcome here. The next time you hear that phrase, will you say it with me? In our classroom, safe and sound, fears are lost, hope is found. Raise your hand, we'll go around. All are welcome here. Gather now, let's all take part. We'll make music, we'll make art. We'll share stories from the heart. All are welcome here. Thank you. I'm gonna add something new to that part. First, I'm gonna pat on my legs. Then I'm gonna clap and then I'll snap. And I'm gonna use it with the words. All are welcome here. Try again. All are welcome here. If you can't snap, you can just pretend to snap or you could do something else, but I'll leave that up to you. Let's try this whole page one more time. And this time I want you to say, all are welcome here and do our body percussion at the same time. Gather now, let's all take part. We'll make music, we'll make art. We'll share stories from the heart. All are welcome here. Time for lunch, what a spread. Dozen different kinds of bread. Pass it around till everyone's fed. All are welcome here. That time I added my singing voice to the book. You can always sing along with me, especially if you can read the words. But if you just wanna join in for all are welcome here, that's fine too. Open doors, rush outside, we'll swing, we'll slide, fun side by side. All are welcome here. We're part of a community. Our strength is our diversity. Shelter from adversity. All are welcome here. We'll learn from each other, talents undercover. There's a big world to discover. All are welcome here. So much to learn, so much to do. When the busy day is through, can't wait to come back, start anew. All are welcome here. Head for home, get some rest, greet tomorrow ready and fresh. Our time together is the best. All are welcome here. You have a place here. You have a space here. You are welcome here. This book gets really big. Look at all those people. They are all welcome here in our school. And that's the end of my book. I really love to read this book the first week of school because it reminds us that everyone is welcome in the music room, but everyone is also welcome in our school. 
Thanks for following along with this book. Let's see what's next of my music lesson. Our next activity today is a little rhyming chant, and we're gonna add some body percussion to it. Remember, body percussion is just making music with our hands and other parts of our bodies. So, for example, we might use something like a pat, maybe a snap, maybe a clap. We're gonna use all three of those today. The first thing I want you to do is just follow along with me and make your hands do what mine are doing. That's the pattern for the first part of the song. Now I'm gonna add the rhyming chant to, to our body percussion. And when you catch on to the words, you can join in. And while you're still learning it, you can just listen and follow along with the body percussion. Out goes the rat. Out goes the cat. Out goes the lady with the big green hat. Out goes the rat. Out goes the cat. Out goes the lady with the big green hat. Where did the rat go out, out? Where did the cat go out, out? Where did the lady with the big green hat go out, out, out? Let's go faster. Out goes, sorry, let me start over. <laughs> we'll go a little faster. Out goes the rat, out goes the cat, out goes the lady with the big green hat. Out goes the rat. Out goes the cat. Out goes the lady with the big green hat. Where did the rat go out? Out. Where did the cat go out? Out. Where did the lady with the big green hat go out? Out. Out a little faster. Out goes the rat. Out goes the cat. Out goes the lady with the big green hat. Out goes the rat. Out goes the cat. Out goes the lady with the big green hat. Where did the rat go out? Out. Where did the cat go out? Out. Where did the lady with the big green hat go out? Out. Out. A little faster. Out goes the rat. Out goes the cat. Out goes the lady with the big green hat. Out goes the rat. Out goes the cat. Out goes the lady with the big green hat. Where did the rat go out? Out. Where did the cat go out? Out. Where did the lady with the big green hat go out? Out. Out. Good job. Maybe you can go even faster. And if that's true, you can pause this video here and try it without me. If not, another fun extension could be that you could come up with your own body percussion to add to it. So instead of going pat, clap, pat, snap, you could do something like maybe pat, cross, pat, clap, or you could do something like stomp, stomp, clap, snap. Totally up to you. When, whenever you're done, whenever you've created your own, or maybe you have just done mine a little bit faster, why don't you show someone in your family your new song? See if they can keep up with as fast as you can go. For our next activity, I have a fall poem for you to listen to. After you listen to the poem, we're going to decide which rhythms go with which words are in the poem. Here's the poem. Red, yellow, orange, brown, leaves are falling all around. See them dance, cool fall air, rake and bag them up with care. I'm gonna say it one more time. Red, yellow, orange, brown, leaves are falling all around. See them dance, cool fall air, rake and bag them up with care. Okay, I have laid out the rhythms of this song for you out on the floor using these flashcards. I'm going to say the poem one more time and I'm going to point to the beat we're on using this mallet. I want you to decide if I have laid down the correct rhythm for the words in this poem.
red, yellow, orange, and brown. Now that you've heard the poem, I've laid out this rhythm for you using flashcards. I'm going to say the poem another time, and I'm going to point to the beat we're on using this mallet. I want you to decide if I have laid down the correct rhythm. Listen closely. Red, yellow, orange, brown. Leaves are falling all around. See them dance, cool fall air, rake and bag them up with care. I'm going to say it one more time. Listen and watch closely. I'll give you a hint. There is one incorrect flashcard for every row. Red, yellow, orange, brown. Leaves are falling all around. See them dance, cool fall air. Rake and bag them up with care. Let's look at just the first line. I want you to think about which flashcard you think is wrong. Red, yellow, orange, brown. If you think the second flashcard is wrong, you're correct. There's not a rest here. We say words on it. Red, yellow. If this was a rest, we wouldn't say anything. So we need to take this out and replace it with something different. Red, yellow. I had to clap or I had to touch twice. So is it a quarter note or is it an eighth note pair here? Let's try a quarter note. Red, yellow, orange, brown. That doesn't seem right because there's only one, uh, one rhythm there and we need two. So let's try an eighth note pair. Red, yellow, orange, brown. That's correct. We needed an eighth note pair here for the word yellow. Let's move on to the second row. Leaves are falling all around. Which one is wrong in this row? Leaves are falling all around. If you said the third flashcard, you're right. Leaves are falling all around. Leaves are falling all around. If you said an eighth note pair needs to replace it, you're correct. Leaves are falling all around. That matches with the words. Let's move on to the next row, row three. See them dance, cool fall air. Which one is wrong? See them dance, cool fall air. The fourth one is incorrect. We said the word air right here, but I had put a quarter rest there, which would have meant we had to be silent. Let's see if we can figure out what needs to go here instead. See them dance, cool fall air. The word air only has one syllable, so we need to put in a quarter note. See them dance, 
cool fall air. That sounds right. Let's move on to the fourth line. Rake and bag them up with care. Which one is wrong? Rake and bag them up with care. The third one is wrong. And we need to replace it with a note that has two syllables. Rake and bag them up with care. That means we need an eighth note pair. Rake and bag them up with care. That sounds right. Let's do the whole poem all together and make sure we got all of our rhythms correct. Red, yellow, orange, brown. Leaves are falling all around. See them dance, cool fall air. Rake and bag them up with care. I'm going to now tap on these rhythms, but I'm not gonna say the poem anymore. Instead, I'm gonna say the rhythms we have laid down. And in our school, we say ta and ta di. Ta is for the quarter notes, and ta di is for the eighth note pairs. See if you can clap and say the rhythms along with me. Ta. Toddy, ta, ta, toddy, 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 ta, toddy, ta, toddy, ta, toddy, 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 ta. Now try it without me. I'll point for you, but I want you to clap and say the ta's and toddies all by yourself. Here we go. How'd you do? If you weren't perfect, rewind the video and try again. Let's try it one more time with the words and the rhythms. But this time, I want you to clap the rhythms and try to say the words if you know it. If you don't know the poem quite yet, just clap the rhythms as we say the as I say the poem with you. Red yellow, orange, brown. Leaves are falling all around. See them dance, cool fall air. Rake and bag them up with care. Great job. Thanks for helping me figure out which rhythms went with the words in my poem. For your next and last activity for the day, I have something for you to do all by yourself. And I'm gonna give you two different options. Option number one, you can write a poem all by yourself about fall, and then you can come up with what rhythms go with the words in your poem. Option number two, I'm gonna read you a new poem, and then after that, you can come up with the rhythms that match the words in this new poem. Either option you choose, you need to take the words in a poem and then figure out which rhythms match those words. If you choose option number two, here's the poem that you can use to match the rhythms. As autumn leaves fall all around, they make a blanket on the ground. When winter winds begin to blow, roots are safe from the freezing snow. Good luck either writing your own poem or taking this new poem and figuring out the rhythms.